entrance. Or... Here it is, the amphitheatre that they accidentally discovered, really, back in 1988 when they were building the foundations for the art gallery, which is above. So, obviously, that's not the ideal uh, thing you want to find when you're looking at a, a new prestige building. So this is actually Roman? This is Roman. Um, uh, the deal that was made was that this was made open to the public and preserved, and that allowed uh, agreement for the art gallery above to go ahead. You've got here, this is the bit that a lot of public health people get excited about. This is your actual Roman drain, which you can imagine some of the gore that would needed to have been um, cleansed and flushed from the uh, amphitheatre. Uh, your imagination can run riot with um, some of the things that would have seen over the years. But no one knew exactly where this was, as I say, until it was discovered in uh, 1988. And so what exactly is the building that's above this? So this is, above us is the Guildhall Art Gallery, which is um, the, the art gallery run by the City of London Corporation. Um, and it's a, it's a public art gallery, and that and this is open to the public. Um, there's also parts of the building that are used by officers for meetings, including at the back end. Um, to the south of us, actually, the, the police um, have a lot of offices now, senior police officers are based there. So this is amazing, I mean, for years, I mean, I've seen this in documentaries and PBS specials. Yeah, I mean, R Russell Crowe will be down here in a minute just to show us, you know, go through the whole thing. For our viewers who might not have seen you in our conversations in tobacco harm reduction, who are you? Uh, I'm David McIntosh and I work with Knowledge Action Change on tobacco harm reduction work. And why are you able to bring us down here? Um, well, partly we have a, an event on in um, the art gallery tonight for the Tobacco Harm Reduction Scholarship Program to celebrate three years uh, and also uh, to remember the work that our colleague uh, Kevin Malloy did um, in furthering that work and unfortunately Kevin died earlier this year so it's to celebrate his life and the scholarship program. But also I used to work here, I spent 19 years working uh, in the City of London mainly on drug and alcohol policy uh, and also crime and community safety issues. So uh, this, this is a building I know very well and I used to come and hide down here sometimes when I needed space to think uh, and it's a, yeah, it was a great bolt hole to come and clear your head and think about a few things and maybe reflect that however hard life was in the office people previously had a much harder time. Well, if you're looking for a piece of Rome, here you go.